What is up friends? We are back with another Disney Dreamlight Valley video. This time we are unlocking the forgotten new character in the brand new uh, DLC of Rift in Time, uh, Gaston. Uh, you'll find Gaston in the corner of the desert in the new biome. Pretty easy to, uh, to, um, to find him and pretty easy to forget him. I mean, I had done so much in this game without realizing that he was in the corner. Um, <laughs> So there you go. He's he's feeling the love already. Um, but yeah, we're going to just kick off into this quest. So by talking to him, we're going to introduce ah. the idea of the, the jewel that we're looking for. He is no more interested in helping us, though. Uh. Seems to be a bit delirious. <gasps> so he's too parched. He's wasting away. Uh. He wants green spiky things, which... Presume are either the cactus or the flower the flowers are in spider like creatures that live in the sand and um sweets that on the trees. Right, so this should be pretty easy. Um I think. Famous last words. What what watch and see me be here for an hour. Yeah, okay, so those kind of spiky spiky plants is what he wants. We've already got three of them. We're going to go to the tree. Which is over here. We had already looted the previous one. And after much soul searching, <coughs> googling, I found that the uh, spider-like things he wants to eat are in fact scorpions which you can fish for in the kind of sand water slash goopy stuff beside him. We're out of energy which is terrible. We're going to eat an ice cream because why not? Um, again, my, um, my inventory is pretty bad. I very rarely have space for anything. I'll never learn. So, I'm not sure what colour this... Ah, there we go, we have a scorpion. And there's kelp, for some reason, in the sand. Slash water. So I'm going to give these three items to him. Hopefully that will snap Gaston out of it. That laugh is going to become highly annoying, I suspect. He's going to be the new Maui. <laughs> So Gastonia, I think he, he's been here for quite some time. So he's the ruler of Gastonia. He's been here for quite some time. Um, what are you doing here? Well, I wanted to go away from my village and explore and he became shipwrecked. It's the start of all great adventures. <laughs> he's kind of the same as Rapunzel I'm not going to lie they're both kind of not seeing the bigger picture here and they're both kind of faffing about can't be having that now <laughs> Ah. <laughs> okay so we're going to go to his camp the capital of Gastonia <laughs> Which is sure to uh, be very, very impressive. It, it probably would put my valley to shame because if you've been following any of my videos, you know how atrocious I am at tidiness and planning and building in this game. But we'll get there. Yep, it's already miles better than my valley. <laughs> Tell me your secret, Gaston. Um, huh? Oh, he's missing the foe. The sympathy starts. A sidekick is a friend that helps you out with stuff. They tend to be smaller and very emotionally involved. <laughs> oh yes, then the foe is that. <laughs> you can play that part for me on my quest. 
my quest for the Mirage Wizard. Okay, so he he's come in contact with Jafar. Have you met him? Carrie's a snake-headed staff, uses too many long words. I started seeing him after I established Gastonia. He said this jewel of time was hidden somewhere. Okay. We must find the key to the vault first. Maybe we should check everywhere where you looked again. Oh, we're not we're not really showing much confidence in him, are we? Kicking the man when he's down. Look around the camp for clues to the vault keys whereabouts. Okay. I don't know if we have to use our, our hourglass for this or not, but we'll, we'll see if there's many treasure around. Uh, these were Punzel's paints. I'm gonna pick all the flowers that we can because we're a hoarder. A lot of stuff actually to lose. Oh, it's just memories. I'm hoping you can help me. <laughs> okay, I just saw a glimpse of the spelling there, and he's qu quite illiterate. But listen, we won't judge. We're gonna collect these all together, and we'll read them maybe towards the end. But for now. I'm going to pick up some copper because I can't really find much of that around the valleys. We have coconuts. can't really find the last piece. So let's have a, th let's have a think. There's more time things, but I think that's over there in the other part of the biome. So, mm. Oh, there's a chest. Okay, and in typical fashion, I do not have any room in my bag. We're going to drop the vegetable seed. Coconut husks. <laughs> I must admit, I'm a bit intrigued. I don't know where this is going. <laughs> I've never seen them before. Okay, this is a bit suspicious. <laughs> I don't play with craft items. I hunt and do other things requiring immense strength. <sighs> Aww. Bit of a softer side on you, Gaston. <gasps> oh, his ship was blown off course. Thanks to my natural nautical talents and impressive mm -hmm. skills, he's been here ever since. Okay. I'm impressed. My shipwreck is in the waste, ah. but I can't get through. They suddenly showed up, got in my way. Oh god, we have to collect more mist now to unlock the rest of the biome. I th I would say it's probably maybe six, maybe four or six. We only have three, right? We'll go and do a few tasks. About a half an hour later, and we have enough mm -hmm. mist. Uh, Merlin is probably baked uh -oh. alive in the desert wearing That's that Santa get up. Miraculous. But I don't think I'm ever going to change it back into the blue. Okay, so then we have the we have the rest of the desert unlocked. I think Gaston is probably going to be up here waiting for us. I don't think they, he has to run all the way through. And in typical fashion, we are going to loot, rob, steal, take everything we can within reach as we come. Oh, there he is. Took his time. Hey, let's have a wee chin wag with him. No sign of the vault key. Well, we try. They say we return to the capital and write a song about me. Without the key, there's no jewel of time and the island is doomed. If there is no scarab key, you never mentioned a scarab. What does it matter what the key looks like? <laughs> <laughs> the writing is good. I do like it. Check the quicksand. You'll see I'm right. You're not as skilled as me, but go ahead. Okay. I presume that it's going to be this gold one. No. Oh. Jack's evolving. Level six. We're slowly getting him up to par. Oh, 
okay so it must be this last kind of gold gold glow and it is <laughs> lefo come on lefo I was wondering where I left that. Oh, that's what the pain supplies and the coconuts were for. Me, Lungley, never. I made this Lefo to pass the time, nothing more, though it is an improvement on the original. <laughs> recreating your <laughs> recreating your psychic isn't lonely. He's both mysterious and dashing. I can agree with that. He's going back to his camp. <laughs> The jewel the wizard made up, which can only be full. Yeah. Even if there was treasure to be had, we can't find it. The Mirage wizard said it's in two pieces. An old metal bug. Gaston, describe for me what you think a scarab is. You know a scarab, a long hollow thing you store a sword in. He means a scabbard. That can't be right. I assure you that it is. <laughs> Go hang with your coconut lefo, I'll handle this. Okay, so I have to use the hourglass to find the scarab piece in the plains using the hourglass. And I think we've actually found it here. It was in the main part of the desert, so if you just leave where you were with Gaston just there, um, and you'll find with your hourglass a little a little um, treasure signal. So now we have to go to a holograph, hologram station to talk to Jafar, who's probably going to be very pleased that we are secretly doing his bidding on his behalf. So he created the scarab after all. Hmm. Why didn't you tell me it was in a vault? I wanted to test your metal. <laughs> the fool made no progress. Yeah, he's he's been preoccupied with his coconut mm. foe. <laughs> the second half of the scar remains to be found and Gaston may be able to help you yet. Do not limit your search to the glittering dunes, so we have to go to the jungle as well. Thankfully we've already done Rapunzel. Check on Gaston and Lefo. <laughs> Love it in speech marks. <laughs> Lefo confirmed for next patch. Who's to know? So we're gonna run along now to back to his his highness. This might be the end of the quest. <laughs> He's defending his choices to create Lefo. I'm a grown man. Toys are for children. <laughs> Ouch. Way to read the room. <sighs> don't try your ward traps on me. Why do you care what I think of Coconut Lefo anyway? <laughs> I don't. I only care what I think. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's time for me to take my impressive pursuits again and stop whittling away. Okay. He's, he's in a more <laughs> thoughtful mood, it would seem. <laughs> I need to do rugged and manly things for a while. <sighs> the usual staring into the distance on a lonely peak. <laughs> ah. I'll check back with you in a few hours. I can explore the rest of the I do deserve gifts. Is the Wanderer of the Dunes done? presume we're gonna get a fight yeah the wild tangle swarm explore the wild tangle to see who you meet give gaston some time to recenter himself so i presume it's just maybe on our next login we'll get him thanks very much for watching as always like subscribe really helps the channel out if you enjoyed this video of course um, i'm going to be making a ton more of these walkthrough guys and explore a rift in time the expansion pack for disney's dreamlight valley until next time be safe <gasps>